Hello, all of you being gloriously wonderful people. All right, OBS, come on. Capture the game. Chop, chop. There it is. Okay, first, I want to fix this uh, typo. Thank you. I would have never noticed that. Like, never, ever, ever. How's everybody doing today? What is going on? Uh, this is normally the time of week that the community stream... There. Now it's Astroneer instead of Atroneer. Atroneer would be a whole different game. Uh, I don't know if it'll update on your end or not, but... Uh, it's fixed. At least it should be. Today's awesome. Doing good. Cool, cool, cool. Hello, hello, hello. It's been day for you. It is for me as well. I uh, I normally get I normally sleep in on Saturdays till you know like 10 30, 11. Uh around there. Go away till tip. And uh go away, I said. And my uh, alarm didn't go off because I forgot to set it, and I woke up at 12.50, and the stream normally starts at 1. Uh, so it's, I'm, I'm, you know, a little bit late. Uh, but we're here. It's it's going now, so it's all good, right? Yes. Um, so last night, I left off. I had done part of the missions on Kalidor, and then realized um, my forgot my canister back on Silva like a big dumb. So I'm gonna find some resin. Where's my tractor? There's my tractor. Uh, I'm gonna find some resin. There's some resin. And make a canister real quick. Um, yeah, this, so this is a fairly new save. I just started this save on last night's Switch stream. Um, and have been working through the missions to get the new stuff unlocked. So, yeah, I'm on Kalidor for rail missions right now. I mean, I've done the rail missions a bajillion times, but, uh, oh, wait, I did have a canister. What? I'm so confused. Then why couldn't I build last night? Your save? There's a typo in the stream's title. It should be fixed. It should be fixed. Let me refresh my page to make sure it's fixed. Yes, it is fixed. It, it is, it is, it is fixed. It now says Astroneer. Unless there's another one. So the game updated the crypt itself so much that it made it. Um, I, I heard there were some issues with uh, this update. I know they got one of the issues of people not being able to load into the game uh, temporarily fixed. Uh, and now it's a matter of getting other issues fixed. Um, so, yeah, I need to pause my preview over here. There we go. Cool. Um, what? So, oof, I forgot that those were really low down. <laughs> See the lights, pink and green core of silver. Yes, I'm, I am well acquainted with them. Let's uh, continue down on that ramp and see if we can't get down to those two. So I need like five more. I don't have a jump jet, so I don't want to just jump down there because I'll break my ankles. Donkey, what's up, buddy? Considering shaving. Okay. Thank you. Thank you for sharing that information. I, it's good to know. That, that is life-changing information. Guys, Donkey is considering shaving. Let's see if I can just put this down here. That. That way. I can that's what's up. Gotcha. Un understood. I did ask what's up, didn't I? Oh, I can't see. I can't. I can't. Oh, God. What's happening? Bad things are happening is what is happening. Uh, okay, well, I just fell. I didn't die, but I did fall. Where, where did I just fall from? You know what? This is sal this is salvageable. This is not even a problem. But look, 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 we'll just we'll just put one of these boys right up here, maybe possibly. There, it likes being there. And then we'll put another one right over here, like that. And I have oxygen, <laughs> and I can call the train down and get out of here. Easy. 
Um, I had the uh, Awakening update done. I did it like in about two hours the day it came out on a different save. Um, so I've done it all. Normally I don't kill the plants, but these guys are mean. There. Alright, um, let's just put one more right, right here. I don't care if it connects to that thing over there or not. And then let's call the cars. But yeah, it took me about two hours to, to get it all done. Yeah, I don't like these rail missions. Um, I'm with you. They are... Um, they're not... They're not pleasant. Um, they're just... They're, they're too much. Like... I don't mind the concept. I mean, I do. I don't like fetch quests, but it, it's just too much. Like 20 things on Glacio. Are you kidding me? Bye. See ya. Um, I don't know how many more I got. Paladin gave you some trouble. Yeah, it gave me some trouble too. Uh, last night, uh, Joe did about a 90 minute stream just talking. Like he didn't play the game. He just, they just looked at, uh, stuff uh on reddit and all that oh is that done i should have went with that that was everything okay well i need the train back please oh no it was only nine okay weird um but yeah they uh he was talking about they may uh are oh, you talking about the calendar here gotcha on the, on the, the rails um, I thought you meant Kalidor on the Awakening update, and yeah, people are having trouble with Kalidor on the Awakening update. It's not... It's not crystal clear what you're supposed to do. Like, it, it, the, the, the little hint that the game is giving you is really subtle in Awakening. Like, it's like... I, I, I was stumped on it for about 20 minutes. I'm like, wait, what do I do with this now? And then it, then it, I saw what was happening on the ground, and now I'm like, oh, okay, I get it. Um, oh, we can do that too. Oh my, <laughs> everything just fell from the sky. Do I have, it wants copper, doesn't it? I don't have copper. Right? You want copper? You do. Do I have copper on the shuttle? I don't. Because of course I didn't come prepared. <laughs> exactly. My brain went, okay, too. Yeah. I'm right there with you. What do I have to do next? Um, they belong in the museum. Oh, the obelisks. So I need some dynamite. And if I remember right, there's dynamite in that right over there. I think. I think, I think, I think. I could be wrong. I could be totally wrong. Am I totally wrong? I'm totally wrong, but there's copper. So that helps with the snail. Dynamite should be easy enough to find. I need to collect a bunch of those curious objects. Yeah, that's exactly what I'm going to do. Um, I figured that out like early into that update <laughs> like why don't why would i sit here and blow up all these individually so i just find a bunch pile them up and you know how many do i need just 10. all right cool but they're really deep down if i remember um so what else do you need friend thank you thank you thank you thank you for the the, the subscriber the sub i'm not, i'm not awake yet can you tell I'm pressing all the random buttons and just being a general moron right now. Uh, you. Weasweed seed. Uh, is there a Weasweed nearby? Yes, there is. And I don't have, like, rovers with, you know, big drills and pavers and all that yet, so I'm having to do all this on foot by hand. Ooh, that was an interesting lag there. I'm sorry, Weasweed. I'll replant you, though. There you go. I love weed sweet. It's my favorite plant in the game. Out. 
Yeah, they're pretty easy to find. They're just way down there. Uh, here we go. We will put that right there. And then we will put that on there. Move. What? So, what the corrupt of the game was either a paver or a person logged off with stuff in the back there. Really? I didn't know that was even possible for that to corrupt it. Okay, why am I not getting... How oh, it works. It doesn't matter which small horn you put on it. I'm going to use either one. I'm gonna break dance for you. There you go. Please don't go in that big hole over there. Please don't go in that big hole over there. Please don't go in that big hole over there. Thank you. That would have sucked. Yeah. Yeah, you can use uh, either small horn is fine. I made that big hole. <laughs> I, uh,. Alright, I'm afraid I must now, uh, enslave you, um, or at least make you my prisoner, because, yeah, I'm, I'm very sorry. Cool, unlimited oxygen, let's give him, I don't care if it's the right seed, let's give him a seed. Whoa, hello. <laughs> How many plants were there? Jeez. I know that's not your favorite plant, so I'm going to give you a lot of them. Alright, so we need to go find some dynamite. Uh, and then uh, go to the very depths of Kalidor. And find some uh, stuff to blow up. So I'm going to take the tractor for a little spin. I'll, well, I'll just go find dynamite. I'm not going to bother making it. I could go make it. I'm not going to. Why, why make what I can go find for free, right? Shouldn't take too long. I know I saw some on Calador last night, but you know, I've literally slept since then. So don't fall in that hole either, please. I have a bad habit of like watching where I want to go, not where I'm actually going. If that make Ooh, I want that battery. Please don't murder kill me. I'm gonna I'm just gonna yoink that from you. No. I'm assuming you like this from you. I gladly Thank watch you. your minute of death. <laughs> Every Holy <time>. cow! <laughs> that was all the emotes. What in the world? <laughs> Thank you for subscribing. How do you say your name? Lakai? Lakai? I'm confused on that one. Um, I'm also confused where I was going. I was going over here. That's where this was. Oh, wait, no, it's not. Yay, not my Little cat. Oh, is it little cat? Oh, no, I was on the this person who just subscribed. L-Y-K-A-I. Yeah, you know, yours is pretty easy. Little cat. That's a battery. Which I guess would go there. And then I need that dynamite. I have one spot on my backpack. So I will yoink that, and then let's uh, go do a thing. However, oh, I thought I saw a horn. And I don't know if you guys know this, but there is a space law that all horns must be honked. If you see a horn, even if you can't pick it up and take it back with you to your base, you still have to stop and honk it. It is space law. Uh, I didn't make this law. I totally made this law. But it is space law. And you have to do it. All horns must be honked. The more you know. Alright, so we just need to go deeper now on Calador. I like how there's just like deadly, deadly plants guarding my entrance here. Just, you know, waiting to want to send me flying into the air. No, I am on PC. I just play with a controller, but I am 
Yeah, I can. Well, if I can get a tool tip. Really, you're not gonna. There you go. Yeah, I just use the controller. Um, I find it easier. You know what? I should really not try to make that jump a second time. I'll die. Let's just let's just be smart about this and ride the train to safety. There we go. All right. Let's see how far these little buggers are down below us. I uh, I told people on the Bangladesh Discord that they were welcome to join, but I don't think anybody's interested today. Um, three cave levels down. I need. A, I really need a light. Yeah, they're really deep. Deep, 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 deep. It's kind of looking for like just a natural drop somewhere, but there isn't one. So I guess I'm just gonna make this all by hand, and that'll just have to do. That is too steep. I will fall to my death. That's probably too steep too. That's be fine. Interesting courts. I hear a hiss spine trying to murder me. Oh, it's close too. By the way, have you noticed that the hiss spines like their gas glows now? It's really cool. We'll, we'll try to get a peek at this one. It's like super cool. Where are you? Okay, like literally, where are you? Well, he was shooting at me from around here, but I don't know where he is. Is he right under me? Probably right under me. Yeah, look at that. It glows and it has, like, little effects. Look at that. How cool is that? I'm safe because the ramp will protect me. It's so much... Yeah, it's so much easier to see. And it lights up the area around it. Like, it's just cool looking now. Like, the hispine went from being just entirely annoying to actually kind of cool. Don't vape, kids. It's bad for you. Typical adult doing a thing and then telling kids not to do it. All right. You just finished this ten minutes ago. Nice. I'm uh, I'm having to do the trains missions and the snails missions because, well, at least the trains, because they're required before. The awakening stuff unlocks. I've done it on another save already, but I wanted to live stream it as well. So that, you know, I've got it all documented. So I started the brand new save last night uh, on Twitch. Which, in about, I don't know, two, two and a half hours, uh, we'll be switching over to Twitch. That is where I normally stream. So uh, if you're looking for Vainglorious streams and wondering, like, I never see you live, that's because you're not following me on Twitch. How much farther? Lots farther. Much, 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 much farther. Trains OP. I like the trains themselves. I don't like the missions. Missions. Missions not fun. They're just a little too much. Now that is fine trying to murder kill me. Get lost, nerd. Oh crap, he's right there. <laughs> that was uh Okay. There, he is. He is gone. Oh my god, look how much lower I still have to go. <laughs> like there Oof. Um, okay. Let's get the, the rails connected. This was so much easier when I did it with a, a rover. Why is this not giving me an indicator at all? What's going on? 
You just use the trains for the game. Yeah, that's why I was looking earlier for an existing ramp down. And just like piggyback off of that. Any further? Right. Good there. I'm glad that you can just unlock the trains in the catalog. For most saves, that's what I would do. Um, I was not looking forward to doing the trains missions again. Oh my god, this is so tight that I can't do anything in here. Right there. Cool. I wonder if I'm going to have enough real junction bits. Yeah, I should have. I just do like I did last night and just use our real post. Uh, do you know when the next, next SES vlog comes out? Joe said last night, uh, he actually did a stream on Twitch last night. Just kind of like, uh, let's look at community art and talk about merch and all that. Which, by the way, there is, uh, they did a merch drop. There's stickers and a uh, new color of the Astronaut water bottle. Like that one that you see back there. But now it's red. Um, and you can pre-order... Uh, the Sylvie plush restock that's coming. Um, but he did say at the end of the stream, uh, that the vlog will probably be late this coming week. Um, yeah, I wish I would have gotten the hoverboard. I, I need to do that. After I do, like, Calador, I need to just go make a quick trip to uh, Deslo and knock out the hoverboard stuff. I'm, I'm kind of missing having the hoverboard, to be honest. Nom, 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 nom. Where? Turn blue. Thank you. Alright, now let's not fall to our death, because that would suck. Give me just an angle I can work with. There we go. Yeah, I wouldn't mind having the Sylvie plush, but 40 bucks for something that's just gonna... I don't know. I can speak... I can think of better ways to spend $40. Personally. <laughs> I'm still two levels above these things. Wee vey. I thought this was the level they were on. And then one for your uh, <laughs> mods, yeah. Yep. Absolutely. I usually get by with just two QTs. Uh, I'm usually alright. Because I can, like, turn the portal oxygenator off for a minute. While I'm waiting to do whatever I need to do with the drill. Plus, by the time I get the portable oxygenator, uh, oxygenator, I usually also have a large rover with a big old drill and paver and all that. So I don't really have to use my train tool all that much anymore. Why is it doing this I don't see a connection thing? Are you, that looks like it's way too close. I guess not. If I run out of rails before I get this done, I'm going to be so sad. All right, one more level down. And then we get to do this all over again on so I may make a rover and just build a ramp with a rover and then uh, just drive down uh, Silva. Might be easier, you know? There you go. So what do you guys think of the new uh, printer interface? Like it? Uh, I don't like it. Did I not just make a ramp right here? I didn't just make a ramp right here. Where are you, dude? Got underneath. As long as you don't murder kill me, that's, that's all I care about. You like it, but you hate it? I mean, it's different. I'll give it that. It is. It has definitely been changed. I can acknowledge it. It is different. Uh, better? Uh, I 
so. Oh, I love how when you start getting lower down, your ramps just kind of like get flat really quick. Oh, we're almost there. We're almost there. But you feel like it's worse? I, I, I don't think it's better. I don't think it's worse. I think it's just different. Uh, it's still, you're still scrolling constantly to find stuff you're looking for. Cause there's no good visual indicator on the left side when you're moving through. Yeah, I think we're here. Uh, I think we have arrived. Now it's just a matter of finding what, like four? It should be enough to give me ten, probably. We'll we'll get five or six just to be safe. And then I need to kind of like get down there. I'm gonna call this and then just ride the train down. There's some right over there. I need seven, really. I'll get it. I'll get it. I'll get five. I love that. That little meter turns into a train arrival indicator. It's just so well done. The trains themselves are fantastic. I just don't like the missions. All right. So we need to go grab these things. I see you, big spiky boys. Get me today. There's only one right here? Come on. Come on. Come on, camera. Operate. Get over here. He will blow them up like there. That should be a good safe distance away. Alright. Where's the rest? There's scissors. That's just pointing to the pylons, though, isn't it? Yeah, it's just pointing to the pylons. So there's one over that way. There's one like right there somewhere. Hello? You're right here? Yes, yes. Ah, yes. You're being a sneaky one. Another one just passed it. Cool, cool. Tip. Let's hear it. Walk so slow when you carry it stuff. You get the snail. That unhinders you. Alright, so that'll give me two. You jump right before grabbing something like an obelisk, you can get faster speed. Really? I don't know that. I'm sure I would screw up the timing on that. Oh, Jesus, you scared me, you jerk. <laughs> that was literally a jump scare. <laughs> Rude. Get out of here. You know what? My snail wants to eat you. Oh, my God. That scared me. Uh See I tried it and I didn't I didn't do it right. I guess I didn't do it right again. Because I'm not moving any faster. <laughs> it's fine, we'll just uh do this. There's three, and there's, like, two more over there, I think. And I'm in a nice pile here, so the area of effect from the explosion makes things go boom big. So how many of you have completed the update? The Awakening update, like, got all the way through and now have an, an eighth uh, friend. I don't want that. I want this. I 
feeling like maybe I don't want to do just five and risk it. Because then I'd have to go all the way back up and find another dynamite. I think I want to find like one or two more. That's five right there, yeah? One, two, no, that's like four. But I had five. Hmm. Good sorry, I had five. Alright, well, let's go see if there might be another one around over this way. I doubt it. I'm surprised there's only one right here. It seems like there should be another one close to this. But there's not. You know what? Freaking Stilgar's the champ right now, making this possible. I'm just running around, not even caring about oxygen. They're usually together in pretty big clumps, but maybe not today. Uh, there's something over that way. Keep my eye out for those freaking attacks. There's one over there somewhere. But I can't see! Go away! I need this big giant thing to go away. I can't see around it. Yeah, it's like right on the other side of this wall. There it is. There's two. Question is, now can I find my way back to the uh the train? Wait, I thought that was the food you liked, my dude. Am I wrong? Am I wrong about your food? Yeah, Tactus. Why did that wear down so quick? Alright, yeah, I have no idea how to get back. Um, it's that way somewhere. Right, please get rid of the compass, thank you. Yeah, Eva. In my main save, come on. I don't want to put it down here because it'll pop up into the train and uh, just turn around. Oh, I can walk a little faster. Jeez. But yeah, um, I have a, like a snail playpen where they've all got little uh, gravity globes to, to hang out in. How did I get in here? You know what? Wait, is that way? I'm just going to forge a new path. Close. Did I go down by accident or something? Uh, where's my, my train? I should, I should be able to see it. Right here. Good. Okay, cool. That that gives me like direct access now. You have a cat in your lap. My cat isn't allowed in my, this room with me. Sadly, she likes to unplug stuff from my computer so she can play with the cables. She wants to walk right behind my computer or right behind my monitors and swat at them until uh, she gets one loose and then just play with it. So there's why I don't want to just do the, the juggle thing. If I drop it while it's up in the terrain, it'll just pop up. And then I'll lose it, and then I'll be sad. So this will be number five. We'll get one more and hope that's enough. And if not, uh, profanities will be uttered, and then we'll move on. This is the worst tunnel I've ever built. It goes up and down and up and down. Come on, just get clear of that bit of train so I can drop you. There you go. So wait, where are the other ones? Oh, they're right there. Well, now I gotta get back up there. Good job, me. I could just you know, punch a hole through. Yeah, that's better. Wait, where's my? Where'd my little? I don't go. How am I struggling this hard with something this simple? 
There's my ramp. My little tunnel should be like right here, yeah? I thought so. Oh well, we know it's generally this direction, so we'll just head this direction. Up, 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 up. Bounce off of that, off that wall. Fine. We parkour in this one. Oh, I've already been here. Well, where's where am I trying to go? Low gravity for the wind. This way, there's where I'm trying to go. This is where it is. Wait. Brandon over here getting lost. And then through here? No. This way. How did I get so turned around? Because everything looks the same down here. There we go. Now I'm where I wanted to be. Sweet. So this will be the last one that I grab, and hopefully, anyway. And then we'll uh, blow them up. Hopefully we have 10. If not, prepared to watch Grand Man cry. Where is my little tunnel? Is that my little tunnel? I guess so. Okay, get out of there. I'm here. Oh my god, I hate the way the camera works when you're carrying something like this. I have hated it since early access, and I still hate it today. It's not as bad as it was in early access, but man, it's such pain. Uh, do I have the Xbox app? I think it's on my computer. I don't know. Um, I don't ever use it. I have an Xbox. Xbox 360 and Xbox One. One X or whatever it's called. I don't ever use them. I think I don't feel like paying for Xbox Live Gold. I think this is the way. But this is not the way. Oh, this is definitely not the way. I can get out, I think. Ah, there we go. Cool. You played on Xbox One? We have a few people on our Discord who play on Xbox. Uh, one of our moderators um, plays it with his son now and then on Xbox. Oh, I'm going the wrong freaking way. Good job. <laughs> Reasons why Brandon shouldn't play Astroneer when he's sleepy. Scored you, uh... You banned from Discord or something? Alright, let's hope this is enough, friends. Because I'm... I'm... I'm over it. We'll just use long reach. You don't want to talk about it, that's fair. Oh, on the upside, they did not all go flying everywhere. Oh, yeah, I think we definitely got 10. Sweet. I should have put a storage on this. This is where mouse and keyboard come in handy, because it makes it a lot easier to move stuff quicker. Yeah, it's more than enough. Like, there's eight already, and there's still like five or six on the ground. Nine. I'll give it, train some ears. And ten. Cool. Never ring on my backpack. Yeah, I can carry a couple. I'll just take some souvenirs. You use keyboard on your Xbox. Can you use mouse keyboard on this game on Xbox? That's freaking awesome. I forgot that they give ceramic or clay. All right, so we didn't get two of them, but so we got 15. We got 15 out of that. I could have stopped a long time ago. I didn't know you could use mouse and keyboard on actually on Xbox. That's really cool. It makes it a lot easier to move stuff with the controller. Of 
Like a lot, a lot, a lot. By the way, guys, thanks for the likes on the live stream. I appreciate it. See the like number pop up every once in a while. I think in real life, this train would probably kill someone. And... Just wait for all of those to slowly do their thing. <laughs> Gotta wait for the door to open. eater in the world. It's like, Mom says I gotta chew my food 23 times. See, why can't it pull four of them? There's four slots in there. Oh, can it not pull those? I did not realize that. I thought it could take stuff off there. Hooray! We have done the thing. What do I think about Unity Engine 5 for games? Um, from what I've seen, you know, there, there's a lot of really cool stuff that can be done there. Um, really pretty stuff. It just... Like, the games that have started using it are... Uh, like, even though I don't play Fortnite, I know Fortnite made the change, and that was drastic. Like, <laughs> very drastic. I need a storage. So, we're going to grab this. Make ourselves a printer. The, that was not 30 minutes for that seed. It just wasn't. I thought it was supposed to last 30 minutes when you fed them the right one and only 10 minutes when you fed them just in a generic seed. Could have swore that's what it was. But yeah, like, the the night and day difference in, like, Fortnite that I've seen is just impressive. Yeah, but then I gave it a an attack disc. After that, it's already eaten two attack the seeds just in a short amount of time. Or no, it's eaten one. Come on, need one more resin. Be nice. Give me a resin. There we go. No power. Awesome. Wait, how much power? Oh, I tried. I've got the drill strike three now. So I'm pulling one and a half. Makes sense. Little printer, you are existing for to make one thing and one thing only, and you'll probably never be used again. So enjoy your retirement. <laughs> Excuse me. Elite is making me look like ghostly pale today. I mean, I am ghostly pale, but it usually doesn't you know, call me out like that. Thought I had more scrap than that. One may have gotten away. Alright, cool. So, no, no, no. I want the whole thing. Let's, uh, let's see what is next. I think this is next. Yeah, that's next. Yeah, I'm not, okay, I'm not trying to recall stuff. I did that. So, uh, the Glacio, wait, extra chips provided the Logistic Depot, Glacio, or Logic Depot, Calendar, or Lunum Alloy provided. Really? Really? How many extra chips does it want? We're hit, hitting that. Exo chip, singular. All right. There you go. You can have that. So now I've just got to get an aluminum alloy and a tungsten. Oh, and a copper. Yeah, I've got a copper, don't I? I uh, do not. Okay, fine. We'll go get all that stuff. Ooh. 
go to my very strangely shaped base. Okay, that was kind of cool to land right there. Just gonna go right to it. It's a very small base. Again, this was a uh, new save. So we need to make some tungsten alloy. So that will require that. And then I'm going to need to smelt. It's a good thing we have this one piece of ladder right here. Right here. Need to smelt that. And then we're just going to leave these here for now. Oh, by the way, uh, you guys like where Sylvie lives. What I said last night that that was cruel. <laughs> I think it's funny. Does it smelt? It's, I think it's perfect storage. I may just make a bunch of smelters to store my uh, snails on. It's only take two. <laughs> I just think it looks funny. I am trying to cook silly. I want, I want a snail for dinner. Escargot, man. I think that's all snails. So, just want to... Oh, yeah, we need to put you in the little chamber. Don't we? Get that knocked out. Enjoy your last taste of freedom, sir. And then there shouldn't be anything else on that because I haven't done Calador yet. Or, I mean, uh, <coughs> excuse me, Desolo yet. Um, so that and bites oh speaking of bites i need to make sure have i done all that research oh wow we've gone through all of those already okay i guess so because i've got seventy thousand bites all right fair so yeah now make sure i've got everything let me can i go through here please i don't have everything i don't have the copper no i do Okay, so, track that one. Aluminum alloy, tungsten carbide, copper. That's it. Cool. We're also going to need to get more aluminum soon, so we're a little low on hydrazine, and I don't have a uh, hydrazine automated yet. We're, we are a long way from that. I should take a quick pause and show you guys that, uh, that haven't seen my streams before. My massive automation set up. Let's do that. Let's take a quick little break here. Let's go drop this off. I don't know why I went here instead of Calador. It doesn't matter, but... I can have base. Is that my base? That is my base. I don't know why I thought it was on the computer. Take that out. This, this is where this is where we land here. Ooh, more scrap. So you can have that. You can have that. And you can have that. And is there resin nearby? I want to make another storage. It's not. Haha. <laughs> Can I reach that? Here, yeah, I cannot. Why? Long reach. I want them. Get, get back on it! Hey! Get back on there! That's good enough for now. Uh, I haven't got them yet. That's the next thing to do. Oh wait, this does give me coal? No, oh, I thought coal was at the end. I really thought coal was at the end. 
Oh, he can go live on Silva. I will have that, and I will have that, and that's all I really need to do here, yeah? Yeah. So we will enter, jump back out, so that I can do this here. So what time? Wait, what? We're not going to leave just yet. I'm going to save, and then uh, we're going to go take a peek at, at my save that I... Uh, yeah, we need to do the hoverboard before we do that. But real quick, we're going to jump out to the main menu. I'll show you guys my over-the-top automation that I have going on. Um, that? Yeah, I think it's this file. Big save takes a second to load. But I still don't understand why that is. I have a beastie computer. That's my fast SSDs. Hmm. I just noticed the chat is like really faded. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why we just heard horns, but okay. Ooh, the frame rate. Frame rate. Give me the frame rate. There we go. So, first things first. This is my permanent base here in Glacio. Storage. And uh, production area over here. I just recently traded in all my smelters for middle ones. My favorite part of this base, however... Right back here. This is the save that I've completed uh, Awakening on. This is my favorite part of this save. I walled off some of the areas in this little valley and back behind the mountains and went and got gravity globes for all the snails plus, you know, our new friend. And I just let him hang out all day long. Rolling around. Every once in a while one escapes. Um, but it's pretty rare. But they can score goals, they can honk horns. They like to score goals. And, and uh, they just generally chill all day long. And I like it. For some reason, they like to all be down at that one end, though. I don't know why. So, we'll start with a quick tour of all my automation. We're not going to spend a huge amount of time on it. So, uh, watch as I leave and listen as I leave. Oh, the lights turn off and the horns honk. And when we go back, they'll turn back on. Yeah, the snails and the gravity globe is a cool thing. I discovered it by accident. Like, I didn't know it was a thing. And I was trying to put a snail in a storage. And instead, it snapped into the gravity globe and then took off. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> That's a thing. We're going to go over here where we're automating iron, steel, and carbon. Mainly because carbon is needed for steel. The goal is to get 400 of most things. And I have 400 of everything, but I do have 400 of most things. You can see the auto extractor up there on the hill, some wind. By the way, this entire, all of it that you're about to see is either... Um, Powered by wind and batteries, or solar and batteries, or a combination of both. Like, no RTGs, no generators, just wind and batteries. So, there's a thumper up there with a little train station, and auto arms take it down to the train station to bring the hematite over here. And of course it's done, everything's full. But the way it was set up is it did steel first. So, we had this one smelting into iron, that over the- no, don't give me that. Thank you. Um, a bunch of soil being turned into organic, getting smelted into carbon. We've got the condenser to get the argon, and then this is making the steel. And then there's a storage sensor on there so that when it got full, it turned off that auto arm and turned those two on to start loading those two canisters. Which question? By 
way, did you know you could drive the trains via a gravity globe? Wait, if we stop and get out and gravity globe, grab the train. Depends on how much you want to make. Um, you can work out the math. So two canisters, two medium can or two small canisters gives you eight organic, and each medium soil canister holds what twenty four regular canisters. So basically, eight times twelve is a number ninety six. So out of each medium canister, you can get ninety six organic. Um, So then just multiply however much it is you want to get. I had a dozen. <laughs> I love that. And I, I did that again on uh, Silva. We'll see it here in a minute. So that's a small bit of automation. My goal was to be able to automate everything without having to bring, like, move resources around. So that's why it's on multiple planets. So it made sense since uh, you've got Argon here to do and Hematite. Woo, hello to do the seal here. So we will go to Novus next because it's not a very big operation either. In fact, I think it's the smallest one. I did a, I did a dozen canisters. It took about 20 minutes of driving with the rover to fill them all up. <laughs> no joke. So we've got an extractor up there getting resin, and then just at the bottom of this cave, there's an extractor getting uh, quartz. And we've got some solar up there, some wind over here, a big solar array right there. And that all gets brought in, and of course, again, it's full, so it's all stopped working, but we were just getting our methane, putting those on there, and making silicone. Just right here. Didn't have to move anything. I didn't have to go get anything. I just had to set all this up. And then anytime I need silicone, I can just come up here and get it. So, kind of handy. Sure, we'll go to the sun next. Next door here. Uh, where be the base? I always forget where this base is. There's beacons on it, but I always forget which side of the planet it's on. There it is. There's like two landing spots here. I don't have auto nanocarbon yet. It's because I haven't filled up a titanium alloy yet. Um, the one on this one here on the Sonya is the slowest going one because it has to make hydrazine to make graphene, to make the titanium alloy. So I've got to get double the amount of ammonium that I get from, you know, than everything else. So a lot of it just sits here idle quite often. So we've got wind over there. We've got wind out by a beacon just behind that. And then we've got more wind up there. There's an uh, extractor just like one hill over uh, getting graphite. Uh, everything else is down here. You see there's three different train lines running down here with three different resources. One was lithium, which is done. It's full. Suck. Good job, me. Ooh, don't. Don't. Yep. Okay. I tried my best to line up the pylons on this one just to make it look a little better. Kind of like the effect. So over there, we're getting a uh, Titanite, and it gets brought up. We're not going to go over there to it. Oop, I don't want to go to the floor. But we are getting lithium and ammonium from down here as well. Ammonium, just it's rare to find it in good quantities on the surface. That's my lithium. So you usually on the sun, you have to go down deep. And... Then there's this issue of uh, you have to keep jiggling it 
to uh, keep it going. I was hoping it would empty these storages that I had down here from earlier. Can I grab that storage, please? 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 Thank you. Oh, grab that. Take that. But there. I can just pick it up and put it back down again over and over and over, and it's fine. Like, that will go forever, because it always fills back halfway. And then, when the trains get full, there's a storage sensor that targets the train itself that ships it back and forth automatically. So it's monitoring its own storage and triggering itself to come and go. So when it gets back to the top and is emptied out, it comes back down. Which is, you know, how automation works. You can see I was using train stations, but I don't know, they were kind of wonky the first week they came out or so. Um, and they didn't always travel the direction that you wanted them to when you triggered the train station. So I abandoned the train stations completely. Um, so you'll see that throughout all the automation, just a bunch of discarded train stations. Plus it's cheaper to not use the train stations. You don't have to have as many resources. Yeah, you gotta perfectly dodge going up and down this. You know, there's little bumps in the ramp to, to make it that much harder. But I tried to keep the ramp shallow enough that I could hoverboard up or back up it. If you make them too steep, your hoverboard won't work. It'll just get stuck. So that's that automation. We're going to go to the second biggest one on Silva. And then the big, big ones on Calendar. And it's a mess, so I don't have any fuel on it. Sure. I mean, it's, it is just a big mess. Wait, it says I... Oh, uh, it's just barely any in there. Here. Here. That'll work. So we'll head down to Silva and have our frame rate suffer once again because it's a very, very big base. <clears throat> With a nice waterfall. Not really, but we made it look like that. Painted it. Um, Silva? There you are. That's the nice thing about automating all this stuff. It takes a lot of resources to get it, but then once you have, you never run out of anything. I won't be quite a slideshow. We'll hold 60 frames per second, but I'm used to 144. Yeah, you can see there's a lot going on over there. Again, we're not going to run out to where every individual extractor is, just because there's no need. You can see a beacon out that way. We're getting... Um, in that general direction, clay, uh, compound, and resin. And those are coming over here. To, uh, we got, we made the ceramic first, and then when the ceramic was done, it turned off the ceramic stuff and turned on the clay. And then we also were, once again, from soil, we were making some organic that was being used to make the rubber with resin. And then also with the compound to make plastic, it went into a smelter, which is right there to get the comp the uh, carbon. And then just down that hill right there. Hey, Ron, what's up? Yeah, Ashton here today. Uh, so we're getting quartz, in which we did the glass first. We also had filled up zinc a long time ago. And then there's also all the way down at the green layer, um, a strontium being mined. And this mess of auto arms that all had to be individually filtered because it's all really crowded. So I had to filter them all or they would have picked up the wrong resources. Uh, took a while to get this all set up, but it, it was a lot of fun. And it, it it's all automated. I don't have to do anything. The only one that I will have to bring in resources for is nanocarbon alloy, which I still haven't set up. I need to do. And that train just goes down to the core. That was what I did for the missions. But this was my first base, um, and then I decided I wanted a new base on Glacio. So this one just kind of sits here, being unused. What are you going to do? <clears throat> and then if I need any resources, I just drop a medium canister. Like, I grab those two, drop a medium canister, put that on output, blow up canister, and then boom, I have resources. Easy. But Calador is the big one. 
it, and it's a mess, <laughs> but it works. <coughs> Excuse me. The allergies are not happy with me today. They never are. Your confusion brain, get ready. Calidor is also like the slowest because like, again, a lot of the stuff requires uh, hydrazine. No, I do have two thumpers on ammonium just to try to keep up. And so it's not ammonium I have problems with, but it's graphite. Like, my thumper on my graphite just keeps running out. So, first things first, we're going to ignore the automation side of it real quick and talk about power. We are making 1,011 units. And it's necessary. Because we have to recharge these batteries so everything can keep running at night. Like, we just have to. And that 1,000 is coming from the solar and the batteries combined. Uh, I've found two of the wrecked solar rays and used a winch to bring them over here and then made the rest of these um, all linked together. Because as you know, on Calidor you get 1.75, I think, of its normal output. So that thing normally puts out like 64, it puts out 96, the rect array. And then these are putting out like 20 something, 30 something each. Um, so yeah, this is a mess. Um, and it's kind of divided into two sections. We're getting copper and, or well, malachite and laterite from down there. They were brought to over here to be smelted. Uh, and then again, it's just set up so that once the aluminum alloy was full, it switched off the the one that was feeding the chem lab and instead just loaded straight onto a train that went there. But it, it's full, so it's not sitting there. And then here we had, um, for tungsten alloy, the, uh, once again, another organic, automatic organic thing in the bobber. Uh, and then this was making our tungsten alloy. And then when that got full, it went switched over to making just tungsten. And then we were also using some of that carbon at the same time to make explosive powder over here. And then over on this side is the problem child, just because the graphite and the all of it, all of it just keeps having issues running out, the thumpers running out. So <clears throat> we have two different trains just right there on that beacon bringing in ammonium. We got hydrogen coming in from there to make hydrazine, which gets fed into here with the graphite. Uh, there's two different graphite trains as well. And some on the floor as well, for some reason. And then the graphite uh, filled up graphene first. <clears throat> and now it's working on making diamonds. Once diamonds are full, it will then work on storing just uh, hydrazine and all of that, but it still has a way to go, as you can see. This is the diamond, yes, the diamonds we've got 80 of so far. Um, we'll also be getting graphite stored here eventually, once all the diamonds are done. You can see the copper, aluminum, aluminum alloy, explosive powder, uh, tungsten's not quite full, and tungsten carbide is full. This is, uh, this all took a while. This all took, don't get up there. This all took a long time to set up. Like, I started all this like a month before trains came out. <clears throat> Do I really need all the stuff I'm making? No, of course not. This is not a uh, because of I need it. This is a because I can. It, that's all this is, is a because I can thing. But every train leads out to a thumper somewhere out in the distance. You can see the beacons for them all that's gathering resources and then bringing them back by trains. And so nothing except nanocarbon alloy requires me to do anything except every once in a while I'll go jiggle a thumper so it starts pulling resources again. No, I don't have to move gas. I don't have to move any resources. It just works. The spaghetti definitely hurts a lot of people's brain, but it's cool. And the part that I'm most proud of out of it all is it all runs off of either solar or wind, depending on what planet it's on. And then, of course, batteries for when those two things aren't present. 
I love it. Absolutely love it. Oh yeah, I have cosmetics that I bought that I never uh tried out. Oh, I kinda like that. And I think I've got a palette that came with that, right? The palette come with that? Yeah, the retrograde. Let's switch into that for a while. Ooh, that's very shiny. A suit has retro vibes going on. Not exactly the same, but definitely some retro vibes. Cool, let's uh, head back in and we're gonna go get ourselves a hoverboard. <clears throat> Excuse me. And caffeine. Caffeine is important. This one loads much faster. Cool. Oh, wait, why did I leave that? I want to be up there. That was dumb. Thank you for what? Leaving that spark that hurt your brain? <laughs> Corrupted save is like 7.1 megabytes. That sucks you have a corrupted save. I've had one. I've had one get corrupted. My very first Astroneer save. Um, I should try to... Uh, I should try to get it up and running again. We're going to go to Silver real quick. Silver, thank you. We're going to get the uh, buggy. <laughs> I should try and see if it if it's been if it works now. But it broke. Like the day night cycle broke. And it was just locked. Like it would move every time you took off in a shuttle. It would advance while you were in orbit. But as soon as you went back down to a planet, it was locked again. And then it eventually got to where two, three minutes in it would just crash. It was very sad. Not Pinnick. Um, why is my brain too loud? I need... You read that some game files were fixed by this new update. Have I... Have you updated? Hmm. No clue. Um... That thing makes some noise. Holy crap. Maybe a compound. Do I have another compound just laying around somewhere? Maybe... Possibly? No? Okay. I'll make some. Grab that before I forget. Oh, I have two. I don't need that one. You can have it back. Uh, buggy, buggy. I have a buggy chilling around here somewhere in a box. Is that you over there? No, that's you right there. Cool. Okay. I sure you can live there. That works. Boom. Yeah, it just crashes. <laughs> Makes me really sad. Like, I don't even have it on my hard drive. I mean, I have a copy of it on another hard drive. Well, my mic is really hot today. You guys should have told me I was really loud. That should be better. <laughs> Jesus. She looks so terrified to be up there. <laughs> she doesn't move very much when she's up there. She just blinks every once in a while. <laughs> she's like, please don't put me in this belter. <laughs> I am a horrible human being. By the way, if you're wondering why the holiday tethers and cosmic bobbles and all that are back, um, they had to re-enable those uh, to fix some of the th crashes that people were having uh, when they loaded. Something about some people had their printers still set to the holiday events. And so if they tried to uh, load their game, it would crash. What do we need? We need a tungsten for that one. Yeah? Yeah. Um, and so they were crashing, so that's why they turned on part of the event again. 
was to help those people who were getting the, the crash on load. Or get next to <sighs> Yeah, the, the performance is be better, to be honest. Let's see if we can't get close to Matt. Wait, where is it? Have I not activated something yet? Oh, there it is. Oh, that's really close. Crap. Right, right next to it. Well, it's not Matt. That's the data log. But yeah, it's like, I just need to hop up there. We'll also scan some shells while we're here. I just like work for my way up. You got dynamite for me? We do. I don't have enough space in my backpack to carry these exochips that I'm about to get. They drastically increased on all planets, man. I think it was so people could get all of them and be able to. That's not what I wanted. Uh, be able to see the lore that's involved with them, since this is such a lore heavy. That's my theory. I don't know. They haven't said why there's so many more now. But I think that's why. All right, where are we headed? That away. Play on civil service. So I've noticed it on all the planets. Like last night when I was getting a, a bunch of research off of Glacia, they were everywhere. Just on the surface. How did I run into something that was right there, obviously, through my face? Again. About to do it again. <laughs> what is wrong with me? Why am I like this? Your backflip? Oh, no. not that fair. I've only pulled off a backflip once. I think this is like one of the best planets for a buggy. It's just kind of fun. I don't really do much on. Deslo usually. I like Deslo. I think it's beautiful. Yeah, this thing's far away. What are you cats just scared of nerf guns? I have a good shot on there. Probably the noise in here. My cat has started a new thing where, like, she's always, like, looked at herself in the mirror and, like, heard it herself, her own reflection. I don't know if she thought it was another cat or what, but she's always like admired herself in the mirror. But now she she tries to groom herself by licking the mirror. Um, like she'll walk up to the mirror and you can tell like she's trying to like lick her ear. She'll like lick the mirror where her ear just was, and then she'll wipe her own ear like she just had. Yeah, I'm like, you do realize you're licking the mirror, right? <laughs> like, I find her in the bathroom all the time, just sitting in front of the mirror and licking it. Like, what is wrong with you? Oh my god, I can't get out of this area. She's an adorable little floof, though, so I can forgive her for being weird. And she's super cuddly, like, all... All she ever wants to do is be bad. Turn. Ooh, that's a... Look at that. That field shelter intact. No. It's not. It's busted. Just the way it was sitting there, it looked like it was fully intact. Don't worry, I haven't forgotten about scanning shells. I'm gonna do it. I 
have something for you. I should have brought all the resources that it requires, but I don't remember what they are, so. It's two, there's no there. Yeah, my cat just licks the mirror, man. But it's like she's trying to groom herself. I mean, no joke. Yeah, Finny, you should try, man, because they're, they're everywhere. They're everywhere, everywhere. Even on my existing save, they're everywhere. Um, so it's not just new saves. They're everywhere. I want to see what's in here. So it's That sucks. That's worth having. That's definitely worth having. Uh, that could be helpful, maybe. Is it all the secrets you hold? Yep. Okay, go, we will hit back. Does this thing even want zinc? I don't even know. Do you want zinc? You do. There you go. Kind of zinc, though. Is that really all that was in there? Alright, back to the ship. No, it's not. You lost 10 pounds? That, oof. That sucks. I, uh... Like, my voice is different permanently. I, I was really sick, like... It's been a while back. Like, I was just... Spewing, man, for like three, four days solid, like every half hour. So much that it burned my vocal cords from all the stomach acid going up, which is disgusting. My wheel is stuck in here. Um, and permanently, permanently changed. Just chased you guys around the house and everything. Well, I'm sure they'll get over it. I used to, when I was a little kid, terrorize my cat. She still adored me. I was her person. Out of everybody in the family, she absolutely adored me. Yeah, it'll be fine. Oh, 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 oh. No, you're not like hitting it with something. I can not like slay fetch, which is kind of awesome. Oh, hello, chess piece. Grab that real quick. Whoa, struggle bussing. Should have brought a landing pad with me so I could just get the train. Oh my god, I just going from crater to crater. My cat lost interest in a laser light. Um, every once in a while she'll still play with it, but... For the most part, she just lost interest in it. Uh, Commander Hobo says his cats are the same way. They, like, figured out it was him doing it. And so they lost interest in it. So not every cat likes it. Lexi likes to play fetch. She likes for me to throw a ball or one of her little stuffed mouse... Mouses? Mice? 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 Mouses? What is wrong with me? Um, can I get up here, please? I go... There you go. And uh, I'll throw something for her and she'll go run, run and grab it and chew on it, kick it, and then bring it back to me and drop it in front of me and, look, and start meowing. Like, throw it again, throw it again, throw it again. She's a very vocal cat. She talks a lot. Yes, I know that plural of mouse is my inside. For some reason, my brain just couldn't access that file at the moment and instead substituted mouses. Too much drugs in the 60s. I wasn't alive in the 60s, but you know, there probably were too many drugs in the 60s. Oh, 
Ugh, finally almost back. All this for a freaking hoverboard. But it's gonna come in here. I flip! Oh. Alright. I will have that, please. Thank you. So, we need to go get the terrarium and the stuff for this mat. I don't really care about the VTOL, so I never do the Vasani one. I may in this save, just to say I did it. I love it, it just kind of like tilts. Good, 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 good. This way. And you're up in gods. Uh, we will drop this off here, yes. Let's give it a bit more power. By the way, I found every bit of this power. Well, except for the RG, which I got for missions. But, every bit of it, I went and found. I don't ever have to really make power for my basic saves anymore. Yeah, so we need we need to go on an ammonium run right now. <clears throat> Otherwise, uh, we're not going to be able to get very far. So let's do that real quick. You empty? Sorry. So let's unload some stuff from our backpack just temporarily. I have exochips just like scattered everywhere. Oh, hello, you're big. Actually, you go on this planet, so I'll leave you here. Uh, we'll put the jump jet up there. I don't really need that anymore. Cool. Uh, let's see if we can't get some of this storage combined so I can take one more platform with me. And then we get to go try to find some ammonium. <clears throat> take care, Ron. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah. <clears throat> I hate allergies so much. At least I don't sneeze all the time like most people do with allergies. I just honestly have to. Uh, remember. There aren't any for you on Glacio? That's so weird, man. They were everywhere for me. Alright, we know there's not ammonium in those woods or those woods. Or those woods. Because we searched there. I think it was this way. Find the big craters that I have left. Behind. Yes, there was a shuttle down on that hole. Because where else am I going to put it? I'm done with it. I'll blow it up and scrap it, I guess. I don't have a big enough shredder yet. Maybe we'll get lucky and, uh. Now, that is a possibility, Finnick, because, like, the older a save gets, the harder and harder it is to, like, find the new stuff that gets put in. Because, you know, there's only a certain number of spawn points that are available on each planet. And if you've had a lot of them used up for previous event stuff, then it's very possible that there just isn't enough space. Head tractor. Sorry, someone grab this. Alright, is there ammonium around here somewhere? Yes, good deal. Bring this just a bit closer so I don't have to run back and forth.
damage, and that's super helpful. I think that one's full tank. Storage boots there. Let's leave that there, drop these guys off, and get a couple more. We may as well. Well, we've got a nice supply here because we've still got many places to go. That is weird. You're right, Finnick. That is weird. Ah, uh, seriously. There. There's still a bunch more over here somewhere. Makes gathering resources so much quicker. Here, you can have that. Well, oh, I think that's enough. Gotta get us some hydrogen. Enough to get us through the next several missions. Yeah, let's throw it on the ground. Perfect. Excellent. Well done. And that one too. Good job, Brandon. Fail at the basics of the game. Putting things on another thing. What are you gonna do, huh? You suck at the game. Let's say. By the way, how many of you guys have seen Astro Academy before? The series I did 24, 27 videos, something, I forget how many. Uh, back in 2020. If you didn't have it, you should check it out. And a brand new Ashton Academy is going to launch probably in March, maybe April, but later this year we're going to have more Ashton Academy. Go tractor. Oh, I don't have very much hydrogen. Yeah, yeah, you've seen a few, haven't you? Just a couple. Now we gotta look at my hydrogen. And of course, the wind stops blowing just as we need power for this guy. So those batteries are gonna die super quick. Wind blow. It's not even halfway powered. <clears throat> well, uh, also, probably in the next couple of weeks, I'll open up a thing on the Ashley Academy channel uh, in Discord, which is a channel you have to opt in, opt in to be able to see. Uh, because... Ashley Academy is a community being series. Like I do the voiceovers for the most part. Somebody do have some guest speakers. I record and edit the footage, but the information, like the the stuff that gets included, is contributed largely by the community. At least that's how we did it last time, and I really want to do it again that way. I think it made it better to have a lot of people involved. I need the sun to come up or the wind to blow. You got the wind. Yeah. I have to make one more, so we still have some high energy or some ammonia. 
I know the difference. What do we do? One is gold colored chicklets, the other uh, is green juice. Alright, you can totally drink it, you see? Excuse me. So while we're waiting on that, what do we need to feed Matt? Um, not Matt. Upper, zinc, plastic, and aluminum. So we're gonna need to go get more uh, copper and aluminum. I don't have very much. What kind of seed do you want? What? Remember, dagger root seed. I don't have any of those on me at the moment, so we'll have to just wait till we go back. That should get it all done. Oh, yeah, definitely. There's only four left. We're going to move those over to here. So I can have them all in one thingy, and uh, then just put that thingy in the shuttle. Maybe it makes some better storage for the shuttle too. Is it really ideal? <clears throat> Drop that there. We will take the scrap out for now, and then the trains are gonna live back this way. We're just gonna like drill through the mountain and make the ramp down. I don't have it on me. That's smart. I thought I was still carrying it, forgetting that I had dropped it off just like 10 minutes ago. Where, where did I put it? Over here? Okay. Chronos device. And then we'll run some extenders to connect all this. So we want this kind of like there ish. But I want to roughly line it up. With the base. I mean, it doesn't have to be perfect, perfect, but it might get to be roughly in line with everything. As far as its angle, I can't. Where's the day? Put it that way a little more. Oh, that looks pretty good. Good with that. Live there. Please don't mess up my blood. You messed up my blood service, you jerk! That'll help my power situation now a little bit. So we know it needs a wind and a solar. So we'll give it a wind and a solar. And I'm going to plug it into the rest of the base in just a second. So it's fine that we're taking the power away because it'll still all be shared. In fact, I'm going to do that right now. I don't think I have any extenders, though. I'm going to have to make some. Can I make extenders? Yes. And then we will do the usual of grabbing the power plug, looking in the direction we want it to go, and just dropping one. Do the maximum length. Drop it. Drop it. That just be enough, isn't it? There, and then will that reach to there? Well, and then I want to toggle these to be just networked. Now they're all sharing the same power and oxygen. We have one left. So that power that I lost by putting it up there is now back part of the grid again. You're not ready? What do you need? Probably exo chips, right? What do you need? Three. Well, we got a lot of stuff to do before we go back to Death Slope. Should probably get on that. So it needs two plastic, two aluminum alloy. 
something else. I don't remember what the other thing was. Wish you could like those. Pick up. Now you're ready. That's not what I did. Sorry, I clicked that. Awesome. Lights. <laughs> that was that was cute. <laughs> Just wham. And then we're gonna get Cole and put him on there. Sweet. So this is the one that we wind up needing 32 astronium. We should we should get a uh Get a rover. I really don't want to hand mine 32 astronomy. And I don't want to build a ramp all the way down there either. Well, that stuff can just chill. Let's get back on mission here and start getting the resources we need for this guy. No, this guy. So, zinc and copper. Okay. Uh, and possibly. so I need four malachite, two of these. And then we have laterite, maybe down here. I don't know if we can it or not. You may have mined it all. Uh, there's some possibly still here. Should get a tree platform set up. It says there's more down here. I think, I think that's it. No, no more that way. I really don't want to fall down in that hole. That would be bad. Uh, I have a jump jet, so I wouldn't die. I just, then I'd have to just build a ramp up. And, you know, pleasant. Let's try to get one or two more. I don't. I do have a cancer. Say, where's my cancer? There's just not much left here, though, is the problem. And I'm exposing more death holes. Oof. My chat broken, or did you guys just all get quiet at the same time? That one. Fuck up. Okay. I'm trying to get this stuff over here. I never know if it's by because chat does break sometimes. It just stops showing up for me on my preview window. I never know. Like, whatever just happens all of a sudden like that. I just like, hmm. Oh, you can't hear me when I whisper like that. I thought you could. I guess my mic's not close enough to my face hole. Of course, now you can see the mic in the camera image. I hate that. All right, so let's smelt these friends. Sylvie, so you're in charge of smelting. Wait, I only got one ladder right out of that? Seriously? Oh, that is, that is disappointing. That is very disappointing. Do I have any more of them? That kind of sucks. We're gonna have to go find my ladder right. But first, we need four of these, right? Yeah. One. For all of that, I got one. Who 
Just about I'll take the drill out. It's just soft silver there. Yes, I did almost fall in just then. There's some more right up here though. One. We have a single nugget from all that. Oh. Pretty sure I remember seeing some up here somewhere. Oh, am I thinking of a different mountain range? There should be one nearby somewhere though. It's everywhere in the mountains. That was a little high. I thought I was going to break something. There's some. Mm. 339. We're good. Uh, can viewers join my game? Um, who are established parts of the Bangalore? Frustrated by how slow I'm doing everything, Kenny. Do you play on PC, Finning? Yeah, you play on PC. Come on, there's gotta be more there. Just keep a uh, mountain goat in it here. Ah, there's some. Remember, I used to be terrified of going into the mountains. Yeah, I could probably use one. What's up, Minnie? What does it even take to get an account verified on Steam? You have to own like a certain number of games, is that what it is? Hello. I don't have any room to carry that battery. to life in the shuttle that's in the hole. <laughs> oh, that's that's good, because now I gotta get out of here. Uh, so, putting the shuttle in the hole is kind of uh, come back to haunt me a little bit. It's fine. I can do, I can see up. I can put that up there, get in, get out, and jump up. Nope, that didn't work. Actually, it did. It got me high enough I can dig. There we go. Oh, God, there's another hole. Maybe I should not have things in holes. Maybe. I thought I had a gravity globe here. Oh, no, that's on uh, Glacio. All right, let's go get my dead body stuff. Not far away. Look how close I was. No, but Steam just like buy stuff enough to be five dollars. Ah, uh, that sucks. I have never encountered that because I have a disturbingly large number of games on Steam. Most of which I've never played. Back when I had the uh, Humble Bundle, back before it was, wait, became a crappy thing, back when it was still good, I would just be like, sure, I'll take those 35 games this month. Don't know what any of them are, I'll probably never play them, but yes, I'll play them. I always skip the Medium Shuttle. I have no need for it. I don't use Medium Rover. I don't have much tolerance for the middle game of this. I just really don't. 
I find it. I don't know. The mid game is just kind of meh. Waste of time and resources to me. I try to skip as much as the mid game as possible. Just go straight to late game stuff. Oh, come on. You're not stuck. Not with you. Got a mighty tractor. What? Go. Bruh. See? Look, you're good. You're good. See? Look at that. Just, you just need a little encouragement. Okay, now you're stuck because I didn't turn the corner properly. That's, that's a new problem. And yes, I'm talking to my tractor. But I just find the medium shuttle just isn't... I don't know, it's just not enough storage to justify making it. I'll just limp along with the uh, small one until I can get the big one. All right, so we need to turn all this into copper and then turn two of them into aluminum alloy, but then I also need to go get more laterite. Putting tethers down in the need. I don't know why, I just feel like they'll be lighter right this way. No clue if there really is or not, but. It's just the direction I wanted to go. Wow, I was incredibly wrong. Nothing. Wait, wait. Oh, I saw something. There we go. There's that right. Oh. Also, a big hole. Of course, there's a big hole between me and the ladder, right? I just have to remember how I got back here. There's my ladder right over there. It's this way, yeah? It's this way. Wrong thing. It's generally this direction. Verify, just follow this. It's right here. Yeah, I'm sure here. Yeah. I can't believe I found my way out. I I never can find my way out of a cave. I go down there and I'm lost. I don't like how this base is so much higher than the surrounding terrain. It bothers me. Um you no 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 no. That's not where that was meant to go. That, that, that can start making it my way. Sylvie, I need you to smelt these for me, please. Like, I'm on it, boss. And I have long since forgotten what I'll do. Copper, zinc, lemon molly, plastic. So, uh, for Plastic, I need to smelt through these. We don't have one slumming point. This map is all it needs, right? I'm pretty sure. It's been a while since I've done these. We kind of still have to come back again. 
Nah, Sylvie's fine. She's she's supervising the the smelter for me. She's doing a great job too. She's making sure that you know no gases wind up in there and try to blow up the base. She's doing she's doing a fine job. She does look a little terrified about it though. <laughs> she really does. She just looks a little spooked. Nah, she see the, the toxic fumes come out there and she's way down here. She's totally fine. Osha would completely approve of that. Peta, on the other hand, maybe not. I could just I press the button to make you keep going. I need to get you some food soon there, buddy. Oh, let's go get ourselves a hoverboard and another snail. Uh, and some hydrazine for the shuttle. Because I totally remember that was a thing we had to do a long time ago before I died. And then with the hoverboard, we can come back to Silva and get the final train stuff knocked out. And then do whatever we need to do to, uh... Start on the awakening missions. They might finish awakening tonight. This one is being shy. Just kind of chilling. Okay, not supposed to pass through planets. It's dangerous. Right, let's just try to find a landing spot by this dude, um, and then just walk over there. That's that's what it's about. Song. It's like, nope, we've got things to do. Uh, Matt, this way. Thank you. Not too far. It should just be at the top of this, yeah? What it looked like. Yeah, That's for the win, man. Ooh, this is not the easiest train to get across, though. Oh, death everywhere. Oh, I dropped my stuff. Give me that back. Give me that. Give me that. Thank you. So excited to get the hoverboard finally. No more BB and just walking. I may go get that.
There goes my storage. <laughs> it's gone. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, hey, there's the probe right there. <laughs> that was great. That was the best. nearby for some graphite so I would like to have that too I know I passed some graphite didn't I I would really like to have that too I don't see them nearby oh well that sucks let's just check over here real quick so I would like to have both of these things to be my friends. Find them that way. Nope. Right, right here. Nope. Right. right there. Nope. Ow. Alright, well, I guess we're taking just a solar with us. I was kind of hoping there'd just be a packager right here with this wreckage. Sad. I don't get to pick a uh, battery with. Let's see if I can't walk on this ridge. Not fall in. Oh god, it's opening and closing every time I. Out. Oh, this guy looks like it's like in some type of weird flight. Oh, it's outside of the sun now. Oh, I want that. Okay. Uh, hello. so well there for a minute. Beautiful. That'll be a nice little addition. Cool, we got our snail. We'll go back, we'll claim our hoverboard, and then we'll get started on some solo train stuff. It opens up, and it closes, and it opens. It's making so much noise. Talking about what in the next update? about this a little bit last night um that apparently there's there was at least talk and i'm assuming some development on getting some type of content the game that's really geared towards the long-term players um to give us, you know, just more to do. Um, and they were kind of specifically thinking about, you know, the, the people who have taken on big, huge projects and then massive over the top stuff, and even content creators to a degree. Um, uh, you need X. Where did you go? Here. Here, you guard the research. Okay, in fact. Threaten you with research. I'm just gonna turn you into research. How many extra chips does this thing? So I'm kind of excited about that. Um, 
love to see what that might be. Why does it keep jumping down like that? Like, did it, used to, did it always do that? Uh, I didn't check how many extra ships I needed. It needs... Oh, I have to do... Oh, just one. My bad. Okay. I was... There you go. Cool. And there's something about planting a seed. Does it matter what type of seed I plant? I have to find out. Go away. I'm trying to pick that up. Does not matter what seed I play. Yeah, I like the long term game too. Like, I like getting through the basics and then being able to just do whatever I want. You know, just get stuff unlocked to research. Kind of ignore the missions. And just kind of hang out and do stuff. farm thing. But not right now, though. Oh, we'll do it eventually. Oh, quick. Just go. Oh, now I have a second UT. That will be coming handy. Uh, where's my other board? There's my other board. Oh, uh, finally. That's so much better. Oh, that's so much better. Couple with a jump jet. Unstoppable. Alright, so we need to figure out what we're doing here. I mean, what's your next thing? Your next thing is 10 and... Leave a... 32. The mushrooms are really low too, so we're gonna... Oh, I can't though. I was thinking I would start on a large rover, but I don't have everything for a large rover. I don't have a, the ability to make a paver. Yeah, I don't have the ability to make a paper. That kind of sucks. Silicone. I don't have methane. Oh, I can go get some real quick. Provided we can get there when the sun's up. Sonia real quick, or Novus. The methane's what? On Novus and Aatrox, that's it? Right? Yeah. No, I don't want to mess with them with Aatrox. I have enough fuel speech, certainly do. There. I'm also going to grab the RTG that we unlocked. Just have that little bit of extra power. Right there. Right there. I got just texting my phone. And where are we going? Novus. We're going to Novus. I can find it. There it is. Novus kind of was hiding from me there a little bit. 
that's a good position. And it doesn't really matter where we land. I'd like just a bit of space though, so I'm gonna look for something on by one of the gateways. There we go, that should provide me enough space to somewhat move around. Oh, we should get lithium over here. Yes, we should get lithium over here. I should have brought more storage with me, though I don't have anywhere to put it, so it doesn't matter. Uh, methane, please, and thank you. And while you're doing that, I'm gonna go plant. it. roses are absolutely beautiful. And I'm gonna grab that seed. No, it's not your preferred food. It'll work. I'm gonna get a lot of lithium, but I'll be able to get enough to get the mission knocked out. Well, that's helpful. Well, you know what would really help is to uh, dislodge it first. Yeah. I don't know how well we'll get around on Novus with one of these, but can't even get out of here for some reason. What's going on? Why can't I move? There. Okay. That was strange. Let's do it again. It does like it doesn't want to go off the edge. I don't know why you're facing that way, because I'm staring the other way. Make it make it up. There you go. Now I'm stuck. <laughs> because of course I am. What is happening? This is this is a bad idea, isn't it? This is not the the place to use this thing. I can just bounce up from like hole to hole here. I'll be all right. Yeah, this is, this is never gonna work. All right, fine. We won't use that. What's up? I see you. I see you staring at me. I love that plant. Like, is that you? Like, hey. Barely saw this out of the corner of my eye. Wait. I guess the mission knocked out. And uh, gives us a little bit of lithium to use, and hopefully we have some methane awaiting us. Possibly, maybe, except the sun thing never opened up. Sun thing, solar panel. The sun thing. But where is? Oh god, no, I didn't post it on. <laughs> we had solar for like two seconds. We'll spin that this way so that when the sun comes up, we can catch it. Just kind of chill here for a while, I guess. So pretty. So beautiful. I don't have anywhere to store them right now, so I'm not going to bother. I'm trying to think, is there a way I could bring another? None of this stuff requires so looking at anymore, so no. But I just want one canister. I know that's stuff for what I need to make, but I'd like a full canister, please. I am getting hungry. I haven't eaten anything today. Do -do 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 -do. Oh, it's time to switch over to Twitch. We'll do that once we get back to Silva. Body wondering. So is this gonna fill up before we get sun? Days are very short on this. Sun's about to peak up, and as soon as it does. That'll help us. It'll give us up to 13 units per second. Which isn't still quite full power, but better than the four that we currently have. Oh. 
if you're wondering why I switch over to Twitch halfway through, usually this is a community stream in the afternoon for three hours, and three hours on Twitch. Um, that's why. And it's usually not the same game, but today we're just going to pick up right here. Just right here. Um... Oh. Oh, oh. So, I am going to be jumping over to Twitch in just a few minutes. Give me about like 10 minutes. I'm going to grab a quick snack. Um, if you didn't see it earlier, just spam the hell out of that link until the bot like tries to shut me down. And uh, I'll see you guys over there. Thanks for everybody who hung out with me today here on YouTube. And thanks for those of you who subscribed. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in just a few over on Twitch. <laughs>